listen. So what is panning? Panning is when you want the sound to come from a certain direction. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump in here and we can see these knobs here. So you can turn them to the left or you can turn them to the right. So this means if you turn this to the left, your sound will come in your left ear. And if you turn this to the right, this sound will come in your right ear. So we're going to look at a little project here where we got uh, four tracks. Uh, so this is going to be harmonics and individually they don't sound very good, but together we have a little something. So let's listen to these four tracks as we go and play them one by one. The first one here, I think we should have at the place it is. And maybe the second one we do like so, and the third one like so and the fourth one should remain. I lower it a little. Second one. What we want to do is we want to unselect these so that this one is showing instead. Uh, these two can remain, but just for showing, I will do like this. And we will have these to the left as they are, and these to the right as they are. Third one to the right. Fourth one. So let's play them together. One more time. So that's panning, let's check out side chaining. So let's say you have a bass and a kick drum, then you want your bass to be here, and every time your kick hits, you want your bass to disappear at the exact point or moment the kick comes in. So it will go like a 
saw wave like this and every time the kick comes the uh, the bass will move so to show you I have two tracks here on the bottom uh, so this is bass and this is the drums and if we go to the compressor this is the acoustic kick compressor we can click sidechain and we can select our kick so this is the um, let's see this is the bass so we click sidechain on the compressor and then we go and find our kick so the kick will sidechain into the bass so let's hear this here and you can see the kick comes in here and if we listen you see these headphones that's where we can listen when that is turned blue and if we lower the mix we hear the bass more clearly 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 more mix less bass more drums less mix more bass less drums and that's because you want to intertwine the both so they won't sound too separate or that the one of them is too much on top of the other so now we we do maximum mix and you see the spikes of the kick and when we lower the mix it will flatten out and if we remove the kick here so we solo the bass you still hear the kick because it comes into this track see if we do like 50 50 so let's hear without side chain and with it lowers the bass a little and we can make higher bass with the lower mix and the other way around so here we got the cover of Uncover with Sarah Larson and I have chosen a little section here it's not done yet but just to show you so here is the audio track the vocal track and up here we have the piano track and if we go down here to sidechain and select the piano so let's have a listen and don't forget to click on this headphone box here so it turns blue so now you can hear the piano as well and we can drive up the mix so now you just hear the piano less mix And that's just to intertwine the two sounds better so they don't sound too separate and so that they belong together in the mix. So if we play all this together, so it's just... Nobody sees, nobody knows We are a 
that's it. That's panning and that's side chaining. And I will see you in episode six.